right? I'm going to need a little bit of audience participation from you now, very quick. I'm going to say one, two, three, and you're going to say hello, Lee, right? If you don't do it right the first time, though, I'll make you do it again. So put effort into it, yeah? All right? One, two, three. Hello, Lee! Hell. <laughs> now that we've addressed the elephant in the room, we can get going now. Uh, yes? Some more eagle-eyed viewers will have noticed that I am actually the love child of Robert Baratheon and one of the hairy bikers. <laughs> yeah. It doesn't get you as much sex as, you, as you'd think. Uh, so, right, um, some of you looking straight on might not think I look that fat. <laughs> I'm a weird kind of fat, I am. I mean, <laughs> I've got quite muscly legs. My arms are all right. My face isn't that bad, but... Just from the neck to the bollocks. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm, I'm not so fat that I can't see me cock. That's not the joke, people. <laughs> but, uh, but thanks a lot anyway. As I said, I'm not so fat that I can't see me cock. But when I lean over, it kind of looks like a maggot in a brilla pad being squashed by... <laughs> being squashed by a washing up bowl. Uh, well, first, I suppose I better explain myself, really, hadn't I? This, this happened very easily. I didn't try, this just happened over time. Um, basically, because I'm, I'm a depressed monkey that suffers from severe anxiety. So what better way to cure that than to get on stage and try and make people laugh, eh? Uh, I wasn't wanted as a child. And I know a lot of people say that, but I really wasn't. The reason I know this was... My parents told me quite often. <laughs> they really did. Oh, you came along and ruined everything. We only had a one-bedroom flat. I mean, they weren't the only clues, to be honest with you. I mean, as a barber, I had a rattle, but it had a snake at the other end. <laughs> the only thing I was allowed to play with in the bath was a toaster. <laughs> so we need to skip over the rest of my childhood, really, because uh, none of it's good. Being like this, I mean, being massively fat and ugly and damaged in the brain, it's kind of good because when you're depressed, you don't really want a relationship. So if anyone comes across, knows how damaged I am and still wants this sweating and grunting all over them, then I know they've got much bigger problems than I have. <laughs> I, should stay, I, should, I should definitely stay clear of those people. <laughs> <laughs> Ha ha ha!